What's going on people, time for another quick rant So, what really wills me up right Is that UEFA have messed up And I'll tell you why they messed up Right UEFA has issued 6,500 tickets For both Arsenal, my team And Chelsea For their fans to come to travel to Azerbaijan A place that is very difficult to actually get to. You're talking thousands of thousands of thousands of pounds to get there. That's including flights, accommodation, food. It's a joke. And you know what? The rest of the money, the money has actually gone to. It's gone to the sponsors and their families. It's a joke, right? The biggest thing that really pissed me off is Henrik Mkhitaryan. He's not going to be allowed to play because of the tension between Armenia and Azerbaijan. Now, Mkhitaryan is Armenian. And really, it kind of baffles me. It pisses me off as to which. How has it got these political issues that surrounding these two countries and you can't allow to make a man play for... Play, play football It should never have got to this thing It's utterly despicable And it's disgusting You know And UEFA can't even guarantee his safety They can't do it I, I and, and, and I think really Arsenal Right Should boycott this game And if Chelsea w would Would agree They would actually boycott this game as well it's held in the wrong place. Mkhitaryan can't go because of these political issues. Fans are finding it so hard to get to the, get to this um, game. The Europa League final should be staged at somewhere where, you know, there'll be a good added spectacle. But the big added spectacle would be to go to some place that's completely different, and people are going to find it so hard to actually get there. Where's the logic in that? It's so different. It's so. Ugh, it's ludicrous. I don't get it. You wait for have messed up. Why are we as a country, right? Why no, sorry. Why are we as a footballing nation, right? Are taking this? We shouldn't have to take this. You wait for have messed up. FIFA have messed up. You know. And I'm not, I'm not, I'm not just talking about racism. I'm talking about the corruption. I'm talking about the way that the football is run. It's a joke. People can't even enjoy the game anymore. I love football. I loved it. I love football since I was eight years old. I am a passionate Arsenal fan. I don't go to many games, but I will yearn to go to many games. It's ridiculous. It's ridiculous. I'm, I'm, I'm annoyed of how this has gone. You know. Imagine playing in, uh, playing in um, a Europa League final, a big sp spectacle, and most of the fans will, the, the fans are not going to be there. They're going to play in more or less, um, not even a full stadium. And that stadium, by the way, is sixty thousand. It holds sixty thousand people. It's a joke. Six and a half thousand to Arsenal. Six and a thousand, uh, another six and a half thousand um, tickets. That's both sides going to um, the, to the respective teams for ticket allocation. And the rest, the sponsors and their families, get them. It's stupid. It's really, really stupid. Look, it's UEFA have messed up. Right, it's, it's it breaks my heart that Mikatero can't even play in a, in a final, can't even play. Now, you, like Arsenal should still step up to this, as I say, but it's just a joke. It's a, just a joke. I, I I think that it's just ruined the whole kind of spectacle with this whole thing. UEFA have messed up. They should have actually done more, but they don't. All they care about is yeah, it's just the money. That's all they ever care about. It's a joke. 
I don't get it. I seriously don't. Tell me how, tell me how this makes any sense. Because I saw, see that it doesn't. It's a joke. It's ridiculous. And it's just really, really disgusting. I don't get it. I love football, but this makes me love football even less. I'm sorry, but it does.